I believe we've been burning 9,500 calories at the front of the race for an event like Unbound. So finding a nutrition plan that works for you is key. You have to do some personal exploration and personal testing to determine what your metabolism can actually accept. You just can't eat 9,000 calories while sustaining a heavy effort. So you're just mitigating your losses. For myself, I focus on a very large dinner the night before and a very large breakfast, mostly carbohydrates. I try to eat at least every half hour, uh, if not every 20 minutes. And personally, I've found that I run best by ingesting as much solid food, such as bars, for the first at least half of an event. I like eating part of a bar and I like stuffing things up the front of my jersey because it's a really easy, accessible way to, to store. And then maybe halfway through the race, I'll start moving into more gels and shot blocks. And then the last hour or two, it's really focusing more on goos and the kind of quick, fast burning sugar energies. Uh, but I try to get as many bars in the system early as possible because later in the race, it's just really hard to eat, things like that. But I find that slow burning energy is key to have it in the tank as early as possible. As unpleasant as it is, I mix virtually all of my water bottles. But I focus every bottle on being some kind of energy kick. It's nice to have electrolytes and sugars mixed in with your water so you get that extra padding for blood sugar spikes and just to keep you thinking positive. Every race has a little different strategy that's tweaked for the length of the race whether it's heavy elevation gain or not, um, where you tend to want to carry less. A race like Unbound, you are just a pack mule of equipment and nutrition and water. Both 2019 and 2021, I started with four bottles and a reservoir, a two liter reservoir. And then this most recent edition, I designed a aerodynamic frame bag uh, that fit inside my triangle of my bike that I stored my two liter water bladder in, uh, in addition to four bottles. One on the down tube, two in the triangle, and one in a fourth bottle in my pocket. I don't mess around with dehydration, and I carry as much as possible and just try to just offload it. Everybody is almost like on a, a downward trajectory, so if you can just slow your descent into bonking, that's the game. <laughs>